He's a ball. He's, he's, he's innocent. He is a game player. He's going to be a practice player. I'm a practice he player. He wants to be a first team all base guy, guy like his coach. He's going to be a going to be a practice player. Put this on camera. He, 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 going. It's going. he hasn't done anything all practice. And, like now, and now he does two touchdowns. I'm going to be better plays. than my Missoula coach here. No, no. Trust Way me. Better I, I, he was having a sophomore slump until today. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing changed. Right? And, and, and yeah, you I mean you talk about that? I mean, a lot of times people talk about the sophomore slump. Yeah. Is that something you've even, uh, you know, even thought about? You know, I hear, it, but it goes through one ear and out the other. Mm -hmm. So I really don't believe in the sophomore slump. Mm -hmm. If you capable to do what you got to do, you're gonna do it. You know, uh, we've been a defense-based team for the past couple of years, so he was trying to get the offense moving. How much pride are you taking it in, in you know, the, the offensive strides that they've made this fall? I take a lot of pride in it because we didn't uh, accelerate it pretty far from the spring and from uh, last fall. You know, we uh, everything we did last year, I guess, didn't work. So, you know, we're doing things different now, and it's beginning to work. What I really like about the running backs right now is we've got a great battle going, and I think we've got good talent there. I mean, Lorenzo brings a first to that position that we haven't had uh, since Demetrius Crawford a couple of years ago. Uh, I thought Curry Sloan, uh, gosh, it's his first day in pads, and I thought that, you know, the first series he looked a little tentative, and then he really uh, settled down and ran extremely well later on in the scrimmage. And as those two guys got better, then Cody Kirk and C.J. Palmer raised their level. And you can just see the effect of the competition. I, I think we're going to have a great battle there. They're all playing well, and uh, I like what I see there. So we're protected against injury. Uh, we're protected against guys getting tired. If somebody has trouble hanging on to the ball, we've got another guy to get in the game. And I think it's all a good situation. What was the hardest part, you know, trying to adjust? Uh, just the gang speed. It's different from a uh, Juco, mm -hmm. so, yeah. Talk about the differences in game speed. Uh, you know, just uh, which which level do you really notice the speed at? That linebacker, secondary level. All the defense. The whole defense <laughs> flying from everywhere. Uh -huh. So. You know, that was the that was the tough stretch of camp right there. You know, and now um, start maybe doing some uh, game reps for for Fort Lewis and stuff. So, you know, you get through that second week. That's the long week of camp. Now everybody can start healing up a little bit and. Uh, you know, it was good just getting out here. It's bittersweet seeing the offense drive sometimes, but in two weeks that's going to be a pretty nice thing. So, you know, it's good It's good to see that too, and I, I feel like the defense still showed up and made some plays. There's plays on both sides. So. Back, back, and pick. <laughs>